Welcome back to the RV Rundown, where we take a quick look at some of the hottest RV floor plans on the market today. I'm your host, Barry, and I'm standing inside the 2021 Venture RV Sport Trek Touring Edition 343 VBH. The BH stands for bunkhouse. That's the namesake of this beautiful camper. It hosts the whole family, and we're gonna start with that bunk room that's in the back. Here in the rear of the camper, we have a slide. As a matter of fact, there's three slides on this camper. There's one here in the bunk room that goes out. It hosts our sofa. This is a jackknife, so it has some theater seating style amenities. Underneath, you can see that hiding, we've got a table that plugs straight into the floor to add extra dining space. That lays flat to become a bed, and we have a bunk up above it as well. This pops free, lays down. That can support up to 250 pounds. Our bunk beds off to this side have a ladder going up as well as some drawers below. And there's no shortage of storage here behind the entry door to the bunk room. Oh, we got to have this back up and closed real quick. We have even more closet space. There's a hanging rod tucked up in there and nice shelf space up above. Pushing back into the living room and kitchen area, we pass right by one of the coolest things that's going on here. This is a bath and a half floor plan. So this has a half bath that's right off of the main living space. It has a medicine cabinet, a nice sink, and a foot flush toilet, as well as a second exit door. So that's kind of slick as well from a safety standpoint. Looking at our kitchen, we have a 12 volt Furion refrigerator, solid surface countertops. They've given us the sink covers that reveal this giant single basin stainless steel sink, but those also give us more counter space in addition to that. Furion microwave up top, three burner stove with an oven below, loads of storage around it. Off to this side, we have a booth dinette. Now that will drop into a bed and form a space for another two people to sleep. One thing that I passed I'll make quick note of is that there's even more storage off to the side in the form of a pantry or whatever else you can imagine to use that for. Like I was saying, no shortage of storage. Moving on to that and say, say, staying with the storage features, as soon as you come through the door, we have a coat closet. And not only that, but all of our command center is quickly and easily accessible, including the monitoring system for the GoPower Solar that's on board. This has a 190 watt panel up top. It's tied to an inverter. Sitting across from our TV, we have a theater style seating. I say that because this simply folds down. It reveals two cup holders as well as power supplies. These are recliners and they have heat and vibration too. The entertainment center itself features a Kinex flat screen TV. We have a fireplace down low that's going to help offset some of the heating costs. And there's plenty of storage and a nice head unit there as well. The master bath. Full bathroom, this is the one full bathroom in the coach, has a glass stand-up shower surround, foot flush toilet, as well as another medicine cabinet and a stainless steel sink. Plenty of space, that skylight above the shower is certainly gonna open it up for taller people like me to be very comfortable. Moving into the bedroom, the bed is on a slide, it's a queen bed, pushes out with ease, so that's gonna really open this space up, and plus, we have this nice front windshield that's an automotive grade windshield. It lets lots of light into the camper and they built loads of storage in and around it. These shelves up top feature plugs on either side so I can see charging things or even possibly storing things up there as well. For users of a CPAP machine, there is a cubby up top with both tr the traditional USB and a plug and at the foot of the bed, Last but not least in this particular room, we have more storage in the form of drawers, cabinets, and another fireplace. I'm digging on that too. And we also have a spot to hook up a TV. Now, this is a 50 amp service camper. It's equipped with two air conditioners. And guys, there is one more thing I wanna show you. We're gonna go outside and take a quick look at the outside entertainment and kitchen. Let's do it. Here outside at the rear of the camper, we have this awesome huge hatch that opens up to reveal this outside entertainment 
and kitchen. So what have we got out here? We've got a two burner stove, a stainless steel basin sink. We've got speakers that are tied into a head unit that all connects back to this beautiful flat screen TV up top. This is on a swivel mount, so it will come out and aim back at the main patio. There's storage all around it and yet another refrigerator. Guys, I think this is a super cool unit. It's really great for the whole family to go on vacation. If you want to see it, check it out for yourself in person at Southern RV. Until next time, happy camping.